Hey, my name's Austin. I work at District Bicycles. I'm here to talk to you about tubeless. So, a lot of modern bikes come ready to go tubeless, but you have to take out the tube. Major advantages to tubeless. Because you don't have to have a tube inside, it weighs less and there's less rolling resistance because of the amount of material inside your wheel system. To make a tubeless system go, we use a latex-based sealant inside the tire and as soon as you run over a nail, thorn, or little goat heads, it seals up behind it so that you don't lose pressure along the way. This makes it to where you don't have to worry about flats nearly as often, and it weighs a lot less, and you can go faster, which is the whole point. So, basically, this we say goodbye to, and we say hello to this little guy. It's a valve and it replaces the whole tube. Most tubeless systems have a very tight bead and a very tight rim shell. This allows the bead to pop into place and stay there when you're on the road at high pressure. This replaces the tube and allows you to put sealant in mid-ride or even just on a regular basis. If you do have a tubeless setup already and you're worried about getting a flat on the road, the only way that's going to happen if you're full up on sealant and you have a solid system is if you get a large slash in your tire. Now this can be as small as a centimeter or as big as an inch. Like The sealant probably won't seal that, but you can put a tube in it just like normal. All you want to do is make sure to take this little valve out and save it. Usually you're going to have to put a boot inside the tire with the tube so that the tube doesn't pop outside of the the slash on the tire. So if you're worried tubeless is only good for mountain bikers going down steep mountain passes, you're wrong. Road riders can benefit from tubeless as well. Changing a flat is super annoying on the side of the road. So most bike companies have actually been specking their bikes with tubeless ready systems. So if you're worried about not having a tubeless ready system on a road or touring bike, just go to your local bike shop and see. Most likely yours can work. If you're not sure you have a tubeless ready system, go to your local bike shop and see. We can definitely tell if you have a tubeless system just by how tight the tire is on the rim, or the type of rim, or the type of tire. Sometimes it's a little expensive to retrofit some of this stuff, but usually it's pretty easy, and it's definitely worth the money. Less weight, better rolling resistance, fewer flats. All the best things. Hashtag unlearn